In this video I will teach you how to make a quick looping animation. And yes, I said animation and not just looping a video. First drag and drop a fusion composition, then press shift and 5 to open it in the fusion tab. Drag and drop a background node, connect it to the media out. I'll be animating a circle shape, so I will just add a ellipse mask to the background, then add a transform node, then go to the first frame, at least that's where I want my animation to start, then hit a keyframe for the first frame and then place exactly where I want my animation to start. Then I'll go a few frames in, let's say 30, and by holding shift or just dragging on this arrow, I can move my shape to the other corner without adjusting the Y value. So it's a straight line right here. Then if you don't have the spline open, this is the button for it. Then click the zoom to fit button so you can see all of your keyframes. Select both of your keyframes with command A, right click, and I will just go for a quick in and out animation. So this is what we have right now. So to make this loop, with both keyframes still selected, right click, set a loop, and then ping pong effect. Now you get this. To make it a little bit better and more realistic, go to settings of the transform node and then toggle the motion blur. Now this is much better. So as you can see, if we go to the edit tab, doesn't matter how long our fusion composition is, it will continue to loop. 